I was so sure I'd made a video of her back when she was reworked, but oh well, to counter her, pick someone like Nautilus who can essentially keep saying, come back here and ignore her damage. Xin Zhao can also knock her up and above, all the while bursting her quickly, and Kha'Zix is also a great counter because of his chasing and burst potential. Rek'Sai for her burrows and knock up, and Master Yi for his damage make other good counters as well. Evelyn's passive makes her gain health back when below a certain threshold whenever she doesn't attack or get attacked for 4 seconds, and will also camouflage her after level 6. Her Q makes her flourish her lashers in the target direction, dealing magic damage to the first enemy hit. She can keep using it while it remains on cooldown to project a line of spikes in the direction of the attack target. Her W curses a target champion or monster for 5 seconds. Attacking the cursed target will slow them by 65% and also charm them if they've been cursed for at least 2.5 seconds. Her E makes her whip the target with her lashers, dealing magic damage and also granting her extra movement speed for 2 seconds. If she's camouflaged, then using this ability will enhance it, making her dash to the target enemy, also dealing damage to enemies she passes through. Finally, her ultimate makes her untargetable before blinking back a few units, also dealing damage to enemies near the casting position, double the damage versus enemies below 30% HP. This champion's burst is actually much more insane now and you'll have to dodge anything she throws at you after you've been cursed if you don't want to fall in love and be deleted at the same time. You'll most likely find her in the jungle position, in which case you'll take the smite flash combo. In terms of power spikes, you can bet she's gonna start ganking a lot more after she's at level 6, but her level 3 can also be menacing because of her charm, which is an instant hit if she manages to auto you and you're near enough for that. She'll be killing enemies in an instant if she manages to get to mid game with a few kills on her back, but falls off in utility and damage in the late stages of the game. Morellonomicon is great as is the kind of new spellbinder which you don't see many people abusing. Thanks for tuning in, good luck in your match and remember, vision wards come a long way in helping you track her even for ganks, expect her to come from anywhere after level 6, and she'll only charm you after 2.5 seconds of the curse, so use this time to gain some distance. Ultimately, have fun doing it.